Hey, Lazy Girl Approved fam. I am back today with another wig review. I took some time off to get my site launched. My site is officially launched where I am selling wigs. It's lazygirlapproved.com. So go check it out. This wig I'm wearing right now is from my site, um, from my collection. Its name is Dawn. So if you go on there, you want to get this wig, you can go on there and get this lovely lady for $38.99. This is actually my work wig. Actually purchased this wig, um, not this one, this is a new one, but I purchased the same wig a couple years ago and I actually wore it to the interview for the job that I have now. So it is a winner, winner chicken dinner. Totally worth it. I still have my other one um, that I use as well. I just wanted to get this one new and out of the package, you know, for you guys to see to make sure it's exactly the same. I went and found the supplier and ordered some wigs from them because I knew they were amazing. So, but we're not here for her today. Today we are here for Vivica Fox Spectrum. Now this wig, this style wig has been out for a while, but they have a brand new color that is obviously right up my alley. It is Prism. These are available on my site. These are $39. I also have the other colors that I'll show you, but this is uh, Prism, the rainbow lovely lady. Um, I already have her out of the package because I got her out on my live last weekend. So I wanted to show you the package. Let me show you the other colors as well that are available. So there's Galaxy, which is, and these look just like the pictures. Um, so this one is white on top with this like uh, red and orange down to a blue. And I'll pop the picture in editing up of what they look like. And then we have Universe. And this is basically black with some red and orange holograph and then some blue at the bottom. And then Spectrum, who's a gorgeous like green, blue, orange with black. So there are those. But today, today we're here for Prism because Prism is a gorgeous rainbow. Let me show you her card first. And the back is just, just stuffs just the other color I don't know why I don't know why it only has two colors on there Aurora and Galaxy I guess they didn't print new cards um, this does have the biocap technology engineered for long-lasting freshness and these are all brand new in package um, cool max fiber based moisture management antimicrobial effect odor control quick dry so similar to the uh, Bobby Bobby Boss Flex Fit and the, is it Lot & Co. Fresh? Don't quote me on that. But here is this beautiful lady. Da, 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 da. <laughs> yeah, I know. What can I say? Um, there are two combs in the front right next to the parting space and one in the back and adjustable straps. Um, let me get this lace off. I haven't cut it off yet. I did not cut it off on the live, so let's do that, shall we? All right, the lace is cut off. Um, I did measure the cap for you guys. So she is 22 inches circumference, 13 inches from ear to ear and 13 inches from front to back. All right. And even though I sell wigs on my site, you guys, and I'm using this Simply Styling spray, it will be available on my site. I'm waiting for the SDS uh, sheet so that I can ship liquids. Um, even though I sell this stuff on my site. Uh, I'm going to give you still the real, real deal. So if you aren't familiar with Vivica Fox wigs, they are not 
usually high quality like Bobby Boss. So you saw me spray something. I'm honestly going to spray every freaking wig I have with Simply Styling because it's like a little miracle in a bottle. Like you can see the difference between the two sides. It just kind of like tames it down and whatnot. So you can see the difference. Um, but Vivica Fox stuff always needs some sort of product as well as for you to know that they are on the thinner side. Um, I can't speak to all of them, right? But the ones I usually get are the like really colorful ones like this. And those are usually pretty thin. And you'll see in the 360. Does it stop me from getting her wigs? Obviously no. <laughs> so there's that. Now this one, again, I'm going to keep it real with you guys. This one did get a little tweaked in the package. You've seen it happen sometimes to wigs where you just have to really quickly run a hot uh, a flat iron over it. Um, so actually, let me do that real quick. Ooh, that sugar sweet. You got what I need. Sipping on the potion. All that good emotion. Just my kind of keep. Keep it on me, beep. So I just flat ironed it real quick to get those little tweaks out. So still lazy girl approved because that took me all of 20 seconds to do. So it's not like that's just so hard. But um, you can't, well at least I can, hopefully it'll come through in the, the video. You can tell the difference. Um, this is why I say sometimes that some of the wigs just could use a, a good running over with the flat iron because it just I can't explain it except that I feel like it just like melds the fibers more together so they're less separated like you see this side so to me the difference is pretty obvious once you have flat ironed something so especially with bone straight wigs I usually just run a, a flat iron over it real quick the whole thing I'll put it on a mannequin head and just sh 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 and again, that's still technically Lazy Girl approved because when it's a, a light density and it's straight, you're not having to like curl it and do all these things. It's just like a quick, you know, maybe two minutes to do that. So I'm not going to do that right now um, on this video. Um, I wanted to just do the one side to show you. And it even kind of makes the colors, I feel like, pop more. So I just wanted to show you the difference between the two. Um, what I will do now, well, first let's look at, uh, let's look at the hairline. So again, Vivica Fox, if you're not familiar, she's not, she doesn't usually have, you know, amazing hairlines or parting spaces. And you add on top that this is a light colored root. It's a little bit harder. I will say to keep in mind that the lace is on the darker side. So if you have fair skin, just keep that in mind. I mean, I wouldn't be trying to pull this back anyways. There's not very many um, light root wigs that I would actually pull back because it's just very hard to pull it off. Um, you can, but it takes effort, and that's not Lazy Girl. So um, there's a little bit of tangling here. She is, how long is she actually? Hold, please. Okay, so she is 28 inches. This says layered straight. Oh, it is. <laughs> I just couldn't see it in my mirror. So it is a uh, layered salonish cut. There's three layers. So there's this first one, this one, and then the long one. So that's awesome, actually. Um, so I am not going to put powder in the part. I personally don't for light um, roots because I feel like it tends up, tends, it tends, ends up, ends up tends to end up, there we go, that's what I was trying to say, it tends to end up looking orange. So I just kind of leave it um, because when you have really dark hair, which people can tell I do from my eyebrows, it tends to kind of look like this at the root anyways, anyways, where you can see a little bit of dark. So it just looks like, oh, maybe her roots are like, you know, she just had it done and her roots are starting to grow in. So I just leave it like that. Um, let me get you a 360 again. It is going to be thin. I have my ponytail that's like protruding. Um, and so it's going to be more thin right there. 
Um, but again, if you are familiar with Vivica, Vivica's wigs, you will know that's just how, sh how they are. So let's see. I'm trying to think if I should take my ponytail out, but I'm going to just show you guys just like this. So let me, let me show you a 360. <laughs> Sugar sweet, you got what I need. Sipping on the potion, all that good emotion. Just my kind of heat, keep it on repeat. Tested by the potion, love it, this the potion. Live it up, live it up, live it up, sweet emotion. Every time, every night, you and I count a roll. Switch it up, switch it up, switch it up, where I'm going. Okay, so that was the 360, um, and here are my final thoughts. She's $39. Um, I don't know if all of you have seen my review that I did for it was hairdo. And I can't remember whether it was up all night or party, but it was well over a hundred dollars. Um, that's still up on my, uh, Poshmark for sale. Um, <laughs> I think this one is better, even though it's thin. So was that, um, and there was nothing special about that, um, wig. It actually kind of looked party city because the way they did the purple and then the rainbow the, to me, this looks better. Does it suck that it's thin? Yes. But all of Vivica Fox wigs are thin. They're on the thinner side. Now, some people prefer that because then it looks more realistic, which it does in the front. It's just that whole back thing. Like if you really care about whether people know you have a wig on or not, you know, you just have to keep that in mind. Um, it is tangling some, but there's no bone straight long wig that doesn't tangle. So just bring your brush or comb or what have you with you. Um, it's shedding, but it's not like a crazy amount. Again, any wig that is tangly, um, that is bone straight and long, it's going to shed cause you're kind of like pulling at the tangles, right? So does it need product? I would recommend putting S simply styling or something. I'm, I'm telling you, I have about 12 bottles of stuff, you know, wig spray over here. And this is my favorite. I'm like, I could just throw those other ones away. I won't, but, um, yeah. Um, and it could use a quick hot comb. I mean, um, you, you could do a hot comb. I prefer a flat iron when it's bone straight. So it could use that. But again, that's lazy girl approved because it just takes like two minutes, three minutes to do all that. You could put powder on the part. It depends on if you have a darker complexion, it would probably look better and help. But when you have, for me, I've found that when I have a light complexion, I mean, obviously I have a light complexion and when I put the powder in there, it just, when it's a light root, it tends to be like orangey and I've tried the sprays, you know, spray the, the bottom of it. And again, it just looks orange. I bought some other sprays, some tint sprays, lace tint sprays to see if I can find one that is actually nude and not like an orange. Like I just feel like a Oompa Loompa when I do it. So <laughs> Oompa Loompa Doompa Dee Da. <laughs> I like that movie. Um, what else? Uh, the cap is 22 inches in circumference, 13 front to back, 13 ear to ear, and the parting space is three and a half inches deep. Um, the hairline, I wouldn't put it up unless you're really, you know, you want to pluck it and do all sorts of stuff with it. It's not a lazy girl put up, just put, you know, put up out of the package. Um, what else you guys? I mean, she's, I think she's worth 39 bucks and I'm not just saying that cause you can get her on my site. I, I am keeping this. So that means I spent 30 something dollars to, um, you know, have this wig in my private stash. So, um, it is lazy girl approved cause it is now in my wig closet after this. So let me know what you guys think. Again, go to lazygirlapproved.com and get this baby. You can go to the top of the site. There is a wigs by color and just go to rainbow and there she is. And then don't forget, you can also get her other colors, um, which are spe uh, 
Galaxy, Universe, and Aurora. So if you like those two, um, I'll pop some pictures up again. Grab those. There's all sorts of stuff on there. I'm adding new stuff every day. I'm going to specialize in special colors, but I'm going to have regular colors. Like the first one that I had on, I've got some blondes, I've got some blacks, I've got just kind of all sorts of stuff. So, um, and they're all high quality. Um, and if you don't, if you aren't familiar with how this type of thing works, these are not wigs that I have purchased from Outre and Bobby Boss and other people and taken the, the tag off and passed as my own. You will not see that here. If it's an Outre wig, it will come in the Outre package and it will say Outre on there and you will know it's Outre and it'll be an Outre price. Um, I'm not trying to rip people off here. The other wigs that don't have a brand name means that I found a supplier that just sells wigs without a brand name on it to whoever wants to resell them. So there's not a brand. It's basically a Lazy Girl approved brand. Um, I didn't make it, but I am the one who who worked with the supplier to get these wigs, right? So if it doesn't have a brand, that's what the situation is. If it has a brand, it will say Vivica Fox, Outre, Bobby Boss, you know, whatever it may be. So just know that. Um, just want you guys to know that. Um, again, let me know what you think about this. Let me know if you go purchase it. If you do purchase it, please go leave a review on my site. If you purchase any wigs on my site, I'm getting it up and running. You know, in the beginning, it's kind of hard and it helps. Every little bit helps of positive reviews, word of mouth, what have you. So as always, thank you guys for hanging out and spending time with me. I will see you again soon. I am about to go do the other Bobby Boss ones that I promised you that are the red and orange. I did the one and now I need to do the other three. So let me go do that. Bye guys. Ooh, that sugar sweet. You got what I need.